the city of Philadelphia has a new website. Normally that wouldn't be news, but in this case it is, because we need your help getting access to your new Phila.gov login. If you file a BIR, MPT, or wage tax return, and there are any issues in the future, we need to use the new Phila.gov website to receive notices, respond to notices, and stay compliant with Philly. And the process to get on the new website can take a few business days, as you'll see. So we'd love to have access to this account before we need it. That way, we're not scrambling once penalties and interest start accumulating. But before we can get access, we need you to ensure that the address the city has on file for you and your business is your current address. Because once you log into the new website for the first time, before you can do anything within your account, the city's going to mail you a letter at the address they have on file to verify your login attempt. So unless you've received mail recently from the city and you know that your address on file is accurate, we need you to give them a call at 215-686-6600. If you call before noon or after 3 p.m., there's a chance you won't be on hold for long. But sometimes we sit on hold for an hour before someone answers. When someone finally answers, give them your business information, the name, the EIN or social security number on your account, and your current Philly account number all of which can be found on your filed tax returns. And make sure to give them your current address or verify that that's what they have on file. And then that's it. And then head to the new website, tax-services.phila.gov. Under the existing taxpayers panel, on the left side of the Philadelphia Tax Center's homepage, select create a username and password. The site will prompt you to provide your social security number or EIN, now remember, the social security number or EIN that you use must match what Philly has on file for you. Provide some contact information, and then you'll get to actually create the username and password. Don't forget to save these because you'll need them in the next step. Go back to the tax-services.phila.gov website, enter in the username and password that you just created, and click login. Follow the steps to set up two-factor authentication, and then follow the steps to request an access letter. This is the key. This letter will be sent to the address they have on file, which is why you need to make sure they have your correct address. You need the unique letter ID on this letter to be able to access your account and to be able to give us your login so that we can access your account. And this letter being sent through the mail will take at least five to 10 business days to get to the address they have on file. The letter will look like this. And once you have the letter ID, log back into your account, input the ID that's on that letter, and boom, you're in. Send that letter to us, and that's all you need to do. Thank you so much for taking the time to do this. This is going to make your life in the future so much easier.